Kazakhstan embarks on the path of development and innovations, sustainable economic growth, export-oriented products and compliance with international standards is what the state is seeking for. How innovations are created and what results obtain the country? Watch it on the program Innovative Kazakhstan. Hardly anyone would envy our ancestors. Even a common chill for them could have severe consequences. Fractures damaged the body for life and putting a bandage on broken bones was not even thought of. Sick people were left to themselves. Nowadays one can hardly imagine all that, because modern medicine is continuously evolving. Artificial joints, non-invasive treatment of complex illnesses and early diagnosis today make a reality. Innovations in medicine save lives and cure thousands of people. Nowadays complex diseases can be diagnosed by means of the innovative method called functional tomography. Special equipment allows examining patients within a short period of time and, what is most important, with minimal exposure to radiation. At that, different formations and changes in our organism can be revealed. Rapidly, efficiently and painless, presently medical equipment makes it possible to start treatment within several minutes. One of such devices was invented in Kazakhstan. This product is always in demand. At present, we have established promising cooperative links with Western countries. Back pain. Almost each third person in the world has faced this problem. Some people buy up medicines and ointments and prefer to take treatment at home. However, such procedures may not be always effective. It is because patients choose inappropriate drugs or cannot determine the right dosage. Meanwhile, after spending one hour on visiting a doctor, one can forget about this ailment for a long time. Experts proved long ago that the procedures performed using modern equipment were the most efficient treatment. These are the unique methods of stimulation with electric current or infrasound, which quickly relieve backache. The volume of the world medical equipment market is estimated at $250 billion. Moreover, it is increasing annually by 5.5%. Experts predict that within one year this figure will reach $300 billion. China is the largest medical equipment market. Its size is estimated at $2 billion. The main advantage of Chinese equipment is the low cost. According to experts' forecasts, by 2050, Celestial Empire will occupy one-fourth of the world market. The US producers of medical equipment deliver their products mainly to the domestic market and only 10% is designed for export. Because of that, the country has created maximum comfortable conditions for local entrepreneurs. At the same time, the importers of similar products will have to obtain quite a lot of papers before starting to sell their machines on the US territory. In the US, the system of unfair medical marketing is strictly controlled. Medical and pharmaceutical companies are obliged to reveal all information about their remunerations to doctors for advertising their products. For instance, when some medicine is prescribed, a patient can easily find out if the pharmaceutical company pays medics for such advertisement. Radiography is the most popular way of medical examination. This type of equipment is being updated year to year. It becomes less bulky and exerts patients to minimum radiation degree. More than 2.5 million items of X-ray equipment were sold during the last four years. Last year, the volume of world input made up $31.5 billion. This figure is expected to rise to $35 billion this year and will reach $42 billion by 2015. The demand for certain medical equipment increases due to the spread of certain diseases. Thus, for example, according to the World Health Organization, the number of people suffering from hypertension is growing. Along with that, the sales of blood pressure monitors are also continuously increasing. Every day about 2,000 such devices are being sold all over the world. Gadgets safeguarding public health. Tonometers have also been affected by new technologies. Now they are working together with smartphones and tablet computers. For that end, a gadget should be placed on a special device called docking station. The cuff is put on the arm while the results are shown on the screen. 
New technologies will become the main direction for many companies working in the sphere of public health. It is also proven by public opinion polls all over the world. 84% of questioned medical company managers are going to invest their money into new technologies within the nearest five years. 78% prefer to join the world market. 70% of respondents intend to develop new sales channels. Today, people more often download personal medical records to their tablet computers and smartphones. Applications which have been especially developed for this purpose are now hitting all sales records. Experts forecast that only in the US in the next three years, this mobile devices market will reach $6 billion. Innovative medical technologies did not bypass Kazakhstan. The share of imported equipment in the country is very high. That is why special emphasis is put on the advances made by local scientists. Several years ago, a unique device appeared on the domestic market. It cures people by means of infrasound. It consists of generator, oscillator and low-frequency loudspeaker. The internal parts of the body will be examined as soon as you switch on the generator and oscillator. The infrasound therapeutic oscillator, also known as IFS1, restores the functions of any damaged organ at the cellular level. In addition, such therapy favorably affects the fluid balance of the body. The equipment is designed to monitor the body fluid balance. The infrasonic installation makes the water balance in a human body energetically informational as far as 70% of human body consists of water. After that, the immunity improves and the body starts curing itself. Scientists have proved that water has memory. For example, placing a glass of water in a room during a horror movie will completely ruin its H2O crystals. The results of the usage of the installation in practice were tremendous. Of course, following a certain regimen, avoiding unhealthy food and excessive alcohol consumption during the treatment session is necessary. The clinical and laboratory tests of patients, along with their immunologic status, were much better in comparison with those treated with traditional methods. I think that this method has a right to exist and should be widely used in our medicine. Modern developments in medicine nowadays are helping many patients. New methods of treatment of infertility and other illnesses are being created. In some situations, innovative technologies improve the efficiency of some medical procedures. I have conducted my own little statistical research and found out that after treatment with IFS, the effectiveness of extracorporeal fertilization among our patients improved, and pregnancies were often successful at the first attempt. Presently, some joint diseases, which cause many problems to patients, are also curable. Moreover, owing to modern medical equipment, patients feel almost nothing except pleasant vibrations in the targeted part of the body. Each patient feels only some vibrations and there is no pain. It is a relaxation. You know that all our organs are symmetrical, and doctors prescribe the treatment of several points within a certain period of time. Kidneys, for instance, are treated from 5 to 7 minutes. This development has also found its application in modern physiotherapy. Whereas earlier doctors were suspicious of such equipment, by now there are a lot of medical institutions which have begun using this technology. Common physiotherapeutic equipment was based on ultralight sound frequencies exceeding 300,000 Hz. Low-frequency sounds were considered not only useless but dangerous for the organism as well. Before installation, medical equipment is subjected to preclinical tests. It will be suitable for use only after the passing these tests. Initially, we only worked with animals. Later, we completed agreements with some volunteers. And after obtaining positive results, we started treating patients. Limb fractures are one of the most painful injuries. A certain time is required for healing and even after the cast is removed, it is not quite easy to return to normal life. Long time immobilization of a joint, for example, a plaster cast, leads to joint stiffness. Up to date technologies in medicine allow accelerating curing of various injuries. For that purpose, an innovative device has been developed. The patient's card is inserted here. This card sets the device going. The device is equipped with a chip, which is individually selected for each patient. The angles of bending and unbending are also selected individually.
We have got a patient with an acute backache. Magnetic resonance imaging of the lower part of the spine has been made. The image shows central back herniation of the invertebral disc L5-C1. There is the strict indication for operation. But in fact, the operation is not needed. Even such a complex disease can now be treated. It is another achievement of innovative developments. The process is computerized. The individual program for each patient is downloaded into the computer. It contains his or her weight and the information about the pathology. The lumbar part of spine is stretched. After that, we switch on the device and track the lumbar part. In this case, we deal with a large hernia measured 6 mm. By means of traction, we increase the distance between the vertebra and recover the damaged disc. In the course of time, the necessity and special equipment for the development of surgery, ophthalmology and other spheres of medicine emerged. In the 19th century, the Industrial Revolution laid the foundation for the scientific discoveries. These developments have saved million lives during the World War I. Firstly, the information about the qualities of radiation became available in 1895. At that time, the German physicist Wilhelm Konrad Röntgen, in the course of his numerous experiments, discovered the X-radiation. He switched on the current in a cathode ray tube covered with thick black paper. Near crystals of barium were placed which started shining. In this way were discovered rays which were later called Röntgen or X-rays. And this very discovery of the German scientist influenced the development of science called Aronginology. The first X-ray photograph was made in 1896 in Russia. Since then, this method of diagnosing became widespread all over the world. Magnetic resonance tomography, which allows making high-quality images of the brain and spinal cord, also belongs to the most effective tools of diagnosing. The first computerized tomography scanners appeared in hospitals in the early 1980s. As for IFS-1 development, initially it was worked out by the academician Oleg Kazakov. After numerous tests, the scientist came to the conclusion that this technique could treat many diseases. The first medical biological and medical physical trials were made here. It was necessary to prove the influence of infrasound on certain frequencies and in what regimes they could work. After that, two more cups of the functioning device were made. Later on, its influence upon malignant tumors was studied and the efficiency of this device was proved. Modern medicine is an area where innovative technologies are implemented annually. Diseases, which in fact were incurable several years ago, do not kill people anymore. New developments allow revealing diseases on early stages and preventing further pathological processes. Lungs, kidneys and even brain can be transparent. Researchers from Stanford University elaborated a unique method which permits looking right through the body organs. It will allow an easy determination of the structure of various cells as well as accelerate the process of treatment. Step up! A new scientific development is expected to put people with disabilities on their legs and teach them to walk once again. The external skeleton or bionic suit will do this. Special engines will enable people to walk and even regulate the speed and step length by means of the remote control. According to experts, the size of the IT technology market in the area of public health last year made up $78 billion. By 2016, it is expected to reach $92 billion. Soon, not only medics will be able to make electrocardiograms. Modern smartphones will allow their owners to take ECG at any time and in any place. For that purpose, a special device has been worked out which can be connected to a gadget by means of a wireless network. In order to do an ECG, it will be enough to turn your smartphone horizontally and put it on your chest in the heart area. Soon, blood analysis will not be so scary because medical nurses will not miss veins with a needle. Everything is due to the unique system which will enable doctors to see through the skin. As a result, intravenous injections will be done quicker. The system functions with the help of smart glasses for medical personnel. The sales of this innovation have already begun. <laughs>